Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am decorating for Valentine's and I just want to say before I um, get too far into the video, I did um, just recently have the flu and I was very stuffy. So excuse my voice if I sound a little different. But anyway, I um, got this white tree um, from Neiman Marcus this year after Christmas. I got it on sale. I thought it would be perfect under that tr uh, light fixture because I left the tinsel wrapped around the light fixture and the lights coming down. That was up for Christmas and I just left that up. I just took the elves and fairies out of it because I wanted to do like a winter, almost like if you were just walking out in the Antarctica and the polar bears were there and they were celebrating a Valentine's Day. <laughs> I know, I think of the craziest stuff. But anyway, I decorated this entire tree and just hated it. Hated it, hated it. I just was like, this is not the vibe that I was trying to go for. It was too, I don't even know, like the ribbon was just throwing it off or something like that. And look, I just love that tree. It's so pretty. But anyway, I knew I wanted to use these Ditz Bears that I used for Christmas this year. Um, I've used these for Valentine's previously, Christmas, 4th of July. Um, I use them year-round for all the different things. But I knew I wanted to have them sort of the center of attention around this tree. So I completely took apart the other tree and just started from scratch. I have these little, I've had these for years. I can't even believe they still work. They're just these little plastic hearts that have um, just lights on them. And I just put those in the tree. I put three in the front and then you could see the back of the tree like from my eating area. So I had to do back there. So I put one of the lighted hearts back there. These are just little wooden hearts. I believe you're actually supposed to stake them like in your flower bed in your yard. I got those at, at home and I just am using those in the tree. I believe I got those last year. And the little um, heart that the big bear is holding, that is actually a chocolate box. I kept it. It's from Neiman Marcus. I got a box of chocolates um, one time and I was like, it's such a pretty box. It's like um, velvet. So I thought it looked good in his hand. And I just wanted the tree to sort of be, I mean, it can't be, I can't say natural because it's not natural, but just kind of more loose. I don't know how to explain what I was trying to do. But anyway, after Christmas, I ended up buying these pink ornaments um, from Neiman Marcus on sale because they were part of the Christmas um, collection and I'm like oh well I could just use these for valentines so I was trying to play off of like the pinks in the tree but I already had so much red I guess they work together okay I was just honestly throwing me off because they're like a bright fuchsia pink like I got some pink balls that are in the tree you can kind of see but these were like those teardrop shaped ornaments and I ended up hanging them from the actual light fixture down because I was trying to put them on the actual tree and it just was not working and like all these uh sticks and everything I'm putting in the tree those are from Christmas except for the little um like pompous grass I believe is what they're called those are not from Christmas I just recently purchased those for this But like those big sticks in the top were in my uh, tree that was in my living room this year. And also the lights that were um, hanging down from the chandelier were was kind of interfering with like the sticks and everything that were coming out of the top of the tree. So I didn't want it to look too crazy or too messy or I just didn't want it to look like it was too much right there at the top. So anyway, you can kind of see where I'm hanging down the ornaments. I am just using fishing line from, and I'm just tying that onto the light fixture and running it down. And I just tied a couple ornaments onto one string just so that they were kind of hanging in a straight line down. 
And then some of the picks I'm using in the um, tree also were on the stairs for Christmas this year. So I'm always trying to repurpose the different things for different holidays. Thank you. 